After coming up short in the regional finals a year ago, the Three Lakes Blue Jays soccer team is back and they're ready to make a deep playoff run. They were in action Thursday taking on out-of-conference opponent Anigo. The Red Robins looking to strike first. Alex Samolinski wins the ball battle, but his left-footed shot is gobbled up. This one remains scoreless. Just four minutes later, Toby Volkman gets the goalie one-on-one, -on -one and he wins this round. The sophomore gives Three Lakes an early lead, but he wasn't done yet. Trevin Wolkowski threading the needle with this through ball, and Volkman does the rest. He takes it all the way in behind the defense, and that's his second goal of the half. Three Lakes rolls big in this one. Final score, 8-2. to two. A little closer to home in Rhinelander, the Hodags hosting Hayward inside the dome. Rhinelander would get tons of chances in this game. Shane Petrick with a nice setup, but Matthew King's shot sails just high. This game was scoreless for a while. But in the final moments of the half, just like before, Petrick setting up King, but this time his shot finds the back of the net. Hodags are up 1-0. And they weren't done yet, though. Bo Howard, the little chip shot, just over the goalie's fingertips. Ryan Lander goes up by two at the half. Howard would add another goal later on. The Hodags win 3 to nothing. One other soccer score from our area tonight, the Lakeland Union Thunderbirds dominated on the field. They hand Merrill a 10-0 shutout loss. And then in girls volleyball, Three Lakes took on Gresham. And like the soccer team, the girls win in big fashion. The Blue Jays pick up the straight sweep on the night.